Hello everybody and welcome back to Duels of the Roses. My name is Chaos King 136 and today we're taking down Bakura. You would kinda expect, or at least we're taking down Dark Bakura, which you would expect to be someone on Kaiba's side and like normal Mokub er Mokuba Bakura <laughs> Bakura to be on Yugi's side, but now it's Dark uh, Bakura. Anywho, we had to weaken our deck a lot. A lot. To face him, because he's only got 757 deck cost. And he, and that's probably because he has a crap ton of weak monsters, because as you can tell by the little moat surrounding his castle, he has Crush Card. Now his exact field, I don't remember, but let's find out. So you're the one they call the Rose Duelist. I am Bakura. The Britannian... Or Britain? I'm not sure. I'm gonna say Britain, like Champagne. Britain Card Warrior. There was a time when some knew me as Jack Cade of, or Mortimer. You stand on salt soil, where card dueling has been passed on for generations. In particular, my family have mastered the art of the dark duel. Well, shall we begin? Neat. By dark duel, you mean taking advantage of fucking crush card zone? How bad is it? Uh, that's bad. Uh, I have to get rid of this. Also, this is all forest, so it doesn't really help my machine much. Yeah, got shitty fake trap. I think I threw in an extra steel scorpion. Just a whole bunch of weak stuff. We did get our strongest monster that we kept in on the first opening draw, though, our pendulum machine, which is nice. No sign of wasteland, though. All right. Um. Fuck it. We put the fake trap down. What do you even do? You even do the same thing in this? Ah, uh, yeah, it stops Harpy's Feather Duster. Niche as hell. And he's got Dark Flower as his deck litter. Ah! And it has that effect. Life Point Recovery. He's going to gain 50 life points every turn, which... Doesn't amount to much, but if he stalls me out, it can get annoying. Spin the support reins, increase strength of similarly friendly, spellbind specific enemy, and destroy a specific enemy. I would think that those two are exclusive from each other, as in they're not for the same enemy type. Because if they were, it would be kind of pointless. Anywho, and I also don't know if that spellbind is permanent or not. Okay, we're just gonna kill this stupid fake trap because I'm near certain he has no Harpy's Feather Duster. Let's summon you, Megatron. Let's just keep you on the crush card zone. Yeah, he's running. Uh, our other fake trap. Technically, Megatron is safest on the Crush Card Zone. So I think I'll leave him there. I mean, he's just running. He's going to try and stall me out. Another 50. Uh, let's see. Anything good? Nope. Let's just get rid of this damn fake trap and we'll summon a. Uh, 
Armadillo. He can probably kill it, but if he can, then that means he most likely can't get over the cross guard zones. So I feel kind of safe. Not much going on here, he's not attacking, he's just stalling while he gains life points. Uh, what do we got, what do we got, what do we got? More weak ships. We can make a Cybersaurus. Sure, we'll go for a Cybersaurus. And that's it. This is going to take a while, and he's just going to be gaining life in the meantime. What? 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 Come again? What? Yeah, you're too weak. But we haven't seen you attack yet, so... Show me what she got, bunny boy. Not bad. My turn now. Sonic Speed! Still going at this. Can I have a wasteland now? Nope. I can have another Cybersaurus. Sure, let's go for that. Come on, Wasteland. I need it bad right now. Power increase. Oh yeah, I never did look at its graveyard. What the hell was is that thing in the corner? Ah, uh, they're gonna crash. And if I remember correctly, that thing revives itself right next to him when it dies. Now, at least we get to see its attack. He's shooting slime balls at us. Particle effects, ahoy! He's dead, but we're dead too. Bye bye Megatron. You did good. You did good. And the effect activated. Huh? That's not what I thought it was. It didn't affect what I thought it revived itself next to his deck later. Okay, we're gonna have to. Oh, not you. Uh, da, 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 da. Let's take a look. Strengthens all monsters with hex of a thousand or below. When defeated in battle, the adjacent spaces are transformed into crush terrain. The opposing enemy's destruction effects are rendered ineffective. Alrighty. 
Okay, and Wicked Worm Beast is definitely not in his graveyard, so it must have revived. What? Well, where? I saw it do like a little effect. Oh, whatever. Armadillo, kill that. Ah, uh, works. We're gonna skip this one. Skippity, skip, skip, skip. We're almost to his deck later. Server service you go there, server service you go there. What do we have? A bear trap. Sure, let's put the bear trap down. Cyberstein is also pretty good. And he's running. Power increase. Life point gain. He's already. Oh no, he took some damage uh, from uh, attacking my monster before, so yeah, he's still only at 42. This'll help. I probably should have put that in defense, but whatever. Technically, if he tries to come kill me, he'll trigger Bear Trap. Bear Trap! Bye bye, Barrel Lily. That was. Bear Trap was actually useful for once. That's nice. Probably the first and last time. But wait, was it the first? I don't think I've used it on used it successfully on anyone yet. Uh, we got sparks. And we can make a metal dragon. Let's make a metal dragon. Your move, oh, coward. Power increase, yep. Okay, I'm just getting some major slowdown at the moment. Eh, because of the boost from Wasteland, you're not gonna kill me. Eh! Let's see how you attack. And after that, I'm gonna close some stuff on my laptop so that we can have less lag. Alright, he was in defense, so we don't get to see him attack, but we'll see it next turn because he's going in for the attack. More life point gain. Basically, that 50 life points we just did to him, he's gone. Alright, this is now a wasteland spot. Cyber scene, go kill that thing. Yep, that'll re that shoot. Effect activated, and now it's weakened again. Very nice. Now we get to sight see Cyber scene attack. Revenge! I think we've seen him attack once. Just once. Yeah, he's got the rifle hand. A rocket launcher. Grenade launcher? It shoots something. It's a gun. Let's just leave it at that. <laughs> that that chest beat. Cyberstein's useful for once. Yay! Uh, da, 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 da. Will him attacking the deck leader transform it, or does it only when he battles monsters, I wonder? Who knows? Um, you can't do anything. You, two, you three are stuck. What else do we got? We got red medicine. We also have sparks. 
Just for the hell of it. Eat 50 damage. You don't get to... Your... Screw your uh, net gain. You're, you're going uh, flat even this turn. Uh, Metal Dragon, you camp on the Wasteland as a defense. And he's running. Running, running, running. All day long. Yeah, you broke even. Big deal. Hello, Cyber Commander. Uh, using you would make Cyber Steam 1500, so you're a no-go. I could... Besides, I have five monsters out. Now this is some life point gain, you chump. Alright, that's right. I said I would close some stuff. Sorry about that. I don't know if you even saw that, because I'm pretty sure Exploit is only recording the game screen. But anyway. Da, 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 da. Metal Dragon could attack that. And he will. Ooh, just barely... Ooh. What? Come again? When this card is flipped face up, the owning player's summoning power points are increased to maximum value. But that's not that's not what happened. It was you. All cards located on forest terrain are destroyed. Holy shit. Holy... F That's bullshit. That is bullshit. Bullshit of the highest degree. Thank God it didn't kill Metal Dragon. And Wasteland triggers, and you're attacking into a loss now. Let's see what you got, little Neko gal. You're cute. Well, except for your weird-ass tail and your hat. And... <laughs> that, that... That was hilarious. That, that, that death noise. Whatever, we got rid of some of the crush cards, though. And that one he used crush card on is advancing. So let's move Cyberstein to there. Camp it on top of that uh, crush card space. There's a wasteland! Uh, I'll drop it over here. I definitely don't want to flip it here because that'll waste two of the spots. Ideally, I want to flip it here or maybe over here. Because over here, I'm already starting to convert it by attacking with Cyberstein. So yeah, ideally, it would be over there that I drop it. Alright. Let's put an end to this charade. He's attacking. Attacking into a loss yet again. You just don't learn. Cybersteen will just grow stronger. Also, as a plant, I'm pretty sure you lost attack points by being on Wasteland. Ah, how cute. Appropriate considering it's October. Also, 
I should really be saying Stein, since it's supposed to be Frankenstein. But I, I'm so accustomed to saying Steen, because that's how I first read it when I played him in uh, one of the GBA Yu-Gi-Oh games. Anywho... Uh, well, for one, attack. Let's see if it's the effect activates. Yeah, it did! <laughs> now what's under you is Wasteland. And just because it's not worth just slowly moving it up and having to worry about it being eaten. So let's just convert it all. We only wasted one spot of Wasteland anyway. So that's fun. Metal Dragon, kill! Bye bye, Bakura! So much for your dark dueling. Megatron's been promoted, even though he died. Alright. Beast Fangs, Vile Germs, and... So we got three equip cards that we don't want to use. But hey, it's... Equip cards are one of the most important part of the game. No! No way! I warn you, your next field of battle will be your last. Be prepared to meet your maker. Rose card, get. And last... Well, I say last. But we all know we're going to be, uh, we have a couple more opponents after this guy. If the, uh, end of the first campaign with anything to go by. Now we've got Yugi, but he's going to have to wait his turn until the next episode. This has been Chaos King 136 playing Duelist of the Roses. Uh, if you like this video, uh, hit that like button. If you want to see more uh, gaming content from me and my friends, uh, feel free to hit that subscribe button. Thank you and have a nice day.